the Grade 1 Lexus Chase will kick off Day 3, the final day's racing before Christmas and the New Year. It's a three-mile Grade 1. At the top, we've got Hard Hysteria or Leon van Rensburg. Lucky Jack, Padraig Hogan, The Devastator, Joshua Sutherland, Woodlands, Leon van Rensburg, World Class and World Party for David Uli, Devil's Harmony for Dav Darren Thompson, Galway Dancing, David Robertson, Mizuna Judith, Alex Cherry, Nightclubber Craig Beckwith and The Shepherd, Joshua Sutherland, 11 runners in this then. And called in and away with the rain continuing to fall, the sky is dark, almost night time racing as they come down to the first which is a ditch and they will safely get to the other side of it they've got 15 more fences to take and the devastator has gone off into a four length lead well, nightclubber is wide on the track and then Padre Hogan's lucky jack over on the far side it's just about third as they continue towards the next which is the second it's the first plane fence and they're all safely over that one as well with the devastator in front Leading by four. World class has now moved through into second for David Hooley as they get to the third. Joshua Sutherland's second horse is in third. That's the Shepherd. Then, then comes Lucky Jack. And Galway Dancing's after that one. Looking towards the back. Mazuna Judith is just the back marker. And it's the Devastator that's got the lead. Only by about six lengths now. Stable make the Shepherd back in second as they take the fourth, which they all took nicely. And pretty much half of the top horses normally run in this sort of in this race because it's normally the same in real life as they get to the fifth. Around well, the same sort of time of as the King George, but the way our season works, the King George isn't until next or well, next week. Which is in three weeks' time, so always can run in the King George as well, so they can do something that no horse really ever does in real life, and that's with the Lexus and the King George. Let's see if anybody can do that. It's the Devastator who's in the lead. That's a good memory though, because we've got to wait three weeks for the King George. Anyway, they get to the sixth, which they all stream over. And in the meantime, we'll have the real King George, of course, won't we? Next week. Anyway, it's the Devastator in the lead. I'll stop waffling. The Shepherd's in second. Lucky Jack is in third. Then back in fourth is World Class. Devil Harmony is in fifth. Then comes Galway Dancing and World Parties after that one. With Woodlands just in behind. Stablemate Hard Hysteria is about a length and a half behind that one. Then the back two are Nightclubber and Mazuna Judith. And they pass the one in post then with a complete circuit of the track to go. And the Devastator has been in the lead all the way. Champion trainer elect Joshua Sutherland. And I had a little look at the over the seventh they go. And they're all safely over the seventh. Oh, they're not. There's world class has gone. So David Hooley's world class finally obscured from view. Got rid of the jockey at the eighth. And they're all safely over that one. That was the eighth. It was the seventh in which world class departed. Anyway, I was saying I was looking at the standings and stats and stuff. And I've been constantly going on about Leon and Josh being the top two and everything. But for the last two seasons, David Hooley's actually finished second as they get over the next. Last season, Josh won the title and the season before that, Leon won it. But both times, it was David Hooley. He was sandwiching between the two of them. So apologies to him for not... Uh, he wasn't really actually finished second the last two seasons. Anyway, they get over the next. And the Devastator is in the lead from Woodlands in second. Then Lucky Jack and the Shepherd. And Galway Dancing and Devil's Harmony. And Devastator is two lengths clear. Of Woodlands in second. And Lucky Jack on the inside of the Shepherd. And Galway Dancing going well on the outside. Nightclub is now making a bit of a forward move as well as they get over the 12th. It's hard hysteria, just hit a bit of a flat spot. Devil's Harmony is also lost its place and World Party is nearer the back than the front but the Devastator is being joined by Woodlands as they take the fourth from home over that one they all go one or two sloppy jumps at the back but the Devastator Woodlands and the Shepherd are now being joined by Nightclubber and they're going to be the main four 
it would seem, as they race towards the final three fences then in the Lexus chase, and Woodlands has hit the front, Woodlands is in the lead then, the Devastator trying to come back on the inside, the Shepherd is still there as well, Nightclubber looks to be going ominously well in fourth as they come to this final ditch, over it they go, and Woodlands jumped it best and got away from it best, leads by a length, the Devastator second, the Shepherd is third, then comes Nightclubber fourth, Galway dancing, he's running on nicely and now coming to make it a lead in five, as they race down towards the final two, and the Devastator gets back in front over that one though but a better jump again by Woodlands and Woodlands has gone on again it's Woodlands on the inside Devastator closest to us behind them comes Galway Dancing who's moved into third and looks to be a big danger now as they come down towards the final fence in the Lexus it's Woodlands and the Devastator they're head and head Woodlands has been jumping slightly the better but the Devastator's been going better on the flat now Galway Dancing starts to move on again in third this is the final fence and Woodlands gets into it he makes a dreadful mistake and all of a sudden look at this hard hysteria it's come flying from up Absolutely nowhere on the outside. And Hardy Steering now comes through to challenge his stable mate. It's Woodlands in the lead from Hard Hysteria in second. And Woodlands is hanging on into the final furlong. Woodlands is starting to pull away again. Here comes the Shepherd with a renewed run as well. But it's going to be Woodlands who's going to take it. And racing up towards the line, Woodlands takes the Lexus chase. It's going to be close for second between the Shepherd and Nightclub. And then the Devastator, Hard Hysteria, and then Devil's Harmony and Galway Dancing. And what a strange end to that race because. It all changed time and time again. It looked like hard hysteria was coming to win it, and it just stopped. And Woodland started going again. Galway dancing looked to be cruising, and hasn't even finished in the first five, I don't think. Incredible race. Woodland's the winner for Leon Van Rensburg. The Shepherd was second for Joshua Sutherland. Nightclub for Craig Beckwith was third. The Devastator Joshua Sutherland fourth. And hard hysteria for Leon Van Rensburg was fifth.